So this is going to be our final product, but before we can get to this, let's start with the intro. As so as you can see guys, this is my Mercedes-Benz W204. This is a 2008. So yeah, I'm going to be fast dipping the front grill. So the first thing that I did, I removed the front Mercedes-Benz star emblem. I don't like the way it looked. So I'm going to be using this plastic dip to make it black. I want the outer to be black, but the logo to stay shining. So I've been taking this scan for some time and yeah i just want the mixture to be right so now i'm about to maintain my height as i spray and i'll do a, around about three or four or rather four or five coats i guess yeah until the black really comes out and there'll be like 10 minutes between each coat so yeah let me begin the same height right so we're gonna stop there for now because it doesn't have to be perfect at first yeah we'll be back after 10 minutes do a second a third a fourth and a fifth quart Right, so I'm now removing the plastic tape from the Mercedes logo. Right, this is our grill now. Yeah looks kind of okay besides these corners I might have to just dip the corners so that it solid it becomes solid otherwise it looks okay yeah nice right so right about now I've moved inside the garage and the reason was because outside there was so much wind and so much dust so I decided to move inside and I've now cleaned the front grill. I tried isolating the other part and the radiator as you can see. I also will be spraying the front grill and this bottom part to make it look black. So I'm gonna keep the same distance throughout and I'm gonna maintain a constant pace as you are about to see. Make sure you get the corners. So this being the first coat, it doesn't have to be perfect. Now let's go to the bottom part.
same team, constant speed, and same distance throughout. Get the corners. That's enough for now, so we're gonna continue with the coats. As you can see, it's not fully black, but that's okay, because we're still going to do about five or six coats on this car. After every 10 minutes, we apply a coat. Every 10 minutes, we apply a coat. So we're gonna keep doing that until the full color comes out. actually looking better already man I'm enjoying this this is fantastic yeah all right all right guys so unfortunately I wasted um, so much plastic dip dipping this part here as you can see it came out very nice and very clear so the first can is almost out and I still have about four more coats to do on this top grill and the bottom part because i'm doing like um, six coats on this one so i went out and bought another can full can and this is the empty can so yeah i'm now going to go ahead and apply the third coat and then wait for about 10 to 15 minutes and then i'll apply the fourth coat all the way up to the sixth so again, same thing. Your distance should be the same. And then your speed should also be the same. Okay. Just like that. Again, we are not looking for per for perfection right now, as this is the third coat. So we just want to make sure we spray it even. This can is almost done. So let me just um there's few spaces that, that I've missed, so I'm just going to try and come closer and see if I can get those spots. Yeah, seems like I've now got those spots. Yeah.
that is my can just ran out so now we're going to wait for some time and then we'll continue from there guys almost there fourth court and yeah as you can see we are not yet even throughout but yeah we will get there all right so now we have applied all our coats and now i'm about to unwrap the car and see how we did seems like i did get a little bit of a plastic coat here but that's okay i can always use a rag to remove it and i'll use a matchstick to remove um, these ones as you can see Yeah, these ones here, as you can see, um, I got a little bit of uh, plastic dip there, but it just comes off with the paper towel, nice and gentle. So, so yeah, this is what we have for now. Move a little bit back and see. Yeah, this is what we have for now, and. Now I'm going to put back the vent sign. And this is what we have at the moment. Looks dangerous. Yeah. This is sick actually. Yeah. Yeah, this is how it looks. Yeah. It looks cool actually. I am going to link most of the stuff that I used in this video in the description below and also a big shout out to Flex Alexander and Raymond Urias. I know Flex Alexander is thinking of getting a C63, it's still a W204. I know we lost Raymond when he sold his W204 back in the days but shout out to these guys they encouraged me to start uh, posting videos of what i do on my car so i'm going to be doing a couple of projects on this car and i'm going to be posting if you like the new look of the car hit a like if not then comment and let me know how i can improve also don't forget to subscribe for more projects that are going to be coming thanks for watching See you in the next one.